So my X220 had a, uh, I put a custom BIOS on it, and I don't know if that's the reason it didn't post, but for about a couple hours until I got home and took the CMOS battery out of it, um, this thing wouldn't really uh, post, so I, I kind of freaked out and decided to get my Libreboot X220, I mean X61, all uh, all good and ready to go. So I have uh, i3 gaps on it, which is like i3 is a tiling Windows manager. So I don't know if that's making the best use of screen real estate, but it does uh, seem to work all right. And I installed i3 gaps, which is like a variant that adds gaps because that's, well, it makes it look a little bit nicer. So, I did that, I installed a Fe or something. It's like this image viewer you can use, but it also, you can use it to set your background. So, I used that to set the background, and then I, for audio, I just used like Pulse Audio, it wasn't really that complicated. And Wi-Fi WICD, which is actually better than I thought it would be. So um, generally connecting stuff up to university Wi-Fi here can be a pain. So rather than that, um, this is my X61 from a previous video as a Libra boot on it. So I figured um, now that I got it all fully set up and stuff and you know Wi-Fi is working and everything and it doesn't use any non-free or proprietary software I might as well get or donate like five dollars to the FSF so I can get a good new sticker or something to put on it so I did that so yeah now I can I can put a sticker on it like a ram's head Anyways, though, um, yeah, I guess that's about it for the video. Got my X61 here. It's kind of neato, I guess. I mean, it's kind of neat. Oh, oh yeah, I got a new 4-cell battery for it. Like, the 6-cell is kind of bulky, and I'm sure these batteries don't... 4-cell uh, new might be better, might be worse, I don't know. But, yeah, 6-cell battery is a little bit bulky. And I'm probably just going to be carrying around this in my school bag. I might use it instead of the X220 for that. Notes and stuff. Anyways, um, yeah, I guess that's about the video.